Here are some notes on enteral nutrition. Enteral nutrition just means nutrition through the GI tract as opposed to parenteral nutrition, which would be through your IV or your vasculature. In the ICU setting, this usually refers to nutrition through an NG tube or an OG tube. Here you can see a tube at the top, and here that tube is running through the nose as an NG tube. Enteral nutrition prevents and treats malnutrition in patients that are unable or unwilling to sustain oral intake. If a patient has a critical illness, they often have a pro-inflammatory response, which can cause catabolism in the body. Enteral nutrition during the acute phase of illness provides energy substrates to aid cellular functions to attempt to stem losses of lean fat and muscle, which lowers the incidence of mortality and infection. It's often administered through a feeding tube, as we said. It should be initiated within 48 hours if there's no contraindication, and these are the contraindications to enteral nutrition. Intractable vomiting, diarrhea, bowel obstruction, GI ischemia or bleeding, hemodynamic instability, severe or protracted ileus, and high output fistulas.